What are we moving on to now? Well, we're doing that same circuit two more times. What? So yeah, yeah, yeah. Repetition, repetition. So that's how you get. That's how you build your skill. That's how you build your skill. I'm glad I'm not doing this. <laughs> Hi guys, my name is Josh Osborne. Uh, I was a collegiate athlete. I uh, played in Washington, Washington State and University of Washington, and as high as semi-professionally. So after moving to New York, I got my personal training certification, and now I'm uh, personal training and doing soccer instruction. I'm here with NYC Footy, and we've launched this program called Footy Fitness. And every Saturday we're coming down here um, to do some plyometric exercises and build up some soccer skills. Yeah, so the types of things that we'll be getting down to um, here at the field, uh, we'll be doing a lot of ballistic movement and plyometric exercise. So you're working on receiving your own weight and then accelerating back the other way. So it translates to the soccer pitch because you're always doing quick cuts, turning, and running at full capacity and then recovering and trying to get your breath back. That front leg is hopping up. Forward, back, side to side. On one foot, make small T's. So imagining that line, forward and back. One partner on the line, uh, one partner facing the line. And then you'll actually get into individual ball work as well. So you'll bring a ball, uh, we'll get touches on the ball, uh, we'll partner up and work on certain passing and finishing exercises. Okay, so I want you to receive the ball with one thigh and then pass with the opposite foot. Thigh, volley. Thigh, volley. Keep it nice and soft, close to you. Good. Good, yeah, lock that foot in. And then at the end, we'll do a small-sided scrimmage where we get to play um, like 5v5 and, and such. <laughs> Out of breath. You feeling the pain? Yet? Out of breath. You're gonna look like a centaur by the end of this. It's gonna be much more difficult and taxing on the body, but it's it's really really important to simulate those types of conditions. Good ball. <laughs> so players uh, really love it, and they kind of surprise at the end. Before you get out here, I recommend uh, you know you, you eat some some food that won't necessarily upset your stomach. I do a nice a little bit of protein with um, you know a nice fat. So I do like a peanut butter jelly sandwich or some Greek yogurt with some mixed berries and some almond butter, um, a little bit of honey in there as well. It's not going to uh, you know be too much, but you definitely want some fuel. After a session like this, I recommend that you do some light stretching. We do a, a cool down at the end. Um, just keep your body moving throughout the day and definitely hydrate. Gonna, you just sweat it a lot, so you're gonna need electrolytes and uh, just eat some whole foods and keep your body moving. You know, movement is therapy, so uh, move often and move well.